what I want you to do now is um, I want you to um, close the machine door and move into MDI so select MDI press program on there and we're going to call out tool number one so we're going to say T01 01 so the first 01 is the tool number and the second 01 is the offset and then now if you turn your key to auto mode you see your key up the top there yeah go back to to this yeah and now when we hit the cycle start button it'll index to tool one it's already on tool one and call tool one out and that offset is now active and that's got to be active to do what we're going to do next yeah so if you want to open your door now and what we're going to do is we're going to move that tool until it's touching the front face or we're going to move it beyond the front face so we're actually taking a cut so we've got that set so if if it was to cut it would machine that front face off and that's now going to be our z0 okay so when we send that tool to z0 that's where it's going to go and all the other tools will work from it press um, offset and what we're looking for is the work offset so if we look in there you'll see um, offset and you'll see that one that says work yeah. and in there you'll see the six offsets that this machine's got it's got the external one and then it's got G54 through to G59 now the only one that we're going to use is that G54 okay and we're not going to alter the X on anything ever because the X is just center line. So if ever there's an X figure in any of those, we need to take it out because we're going to be in trouble because it's going to shift everything. Yeah. And it's that Z figure there that we're going to set. And all we need to do is on that Z, all we've got to do is we just say Z zero. And then when we press measure, yeah. you'll see that that will put that figure in there. Yeah. And that's now set that to zero. And you'll notice on your absolute position it now says zero because it's actually set it and that's set it in g54 and in every program we'll always call that out g54 just in case someone changed the other work offsets are mainly for if you've got a sub spindle or something like that in which case you would have to um, set the sub spindle as well but we're only ever going to set that okay now there are there are other ways of setting these if we look on our offset you should see somewhere um, if I can find it work shift yeah. now work shift is the other way of setting it um, but we're not using that so again that should always be empty okay but it's a choice whether you use that or you use G54 but this machine's been set up previously to use 54 so I was going to stick with that. 